Hello friends, we come to you with car chat. We haven't done this in a long time, <laughs> right? We are leaving our house. I haven't left the house really in a couple days. He's had to go to work, he's been safe, playing it safe and trying to be in the office as much as he can and then wearing a mask. But good news this morning, one less child in the house, actually three less children in the house. You saw yesterday that Kaylee and Abby tested negative. That test, do not get that test on Amazon. Yes, it came faster. Super annoying to take. Super to it, it easily took 45 minutes for us to take those two tests yes, yeah. because you you had to like start it and watch every single video for every single step and then wait 15 minutes for the results. Plus you have to download an app. What do you need an app for? I, know. I think it. it's so that you can upload the results like to digital verification. I yeah. Guess. If you need it for like, yeah, then I guess that works. It, it said, but... would you like to um, forward your results to someone and you could, but Regardless, too negative with them, and we did it last night, and I'm so glad we did. We would not have had time before they went to school this morning. I'm and glad we did it. Showed no <clears throat> symptoms. They showed yeah. nothing. I mean, so the, and we knew that. Um, and then <coughs> this morning, sorry, we tested Ashley with my other Binax test. It's the last one we have, and that was negative. She's like, Oh, I have to go to school. <laughs> yes, you have to go to school. It's a, a little pill. Um, but, but that was too early in the morning to pull out the camera and um, she literally was laying in bed when I swabbed her and um, got the negative result for her. So I sent her off to school. So we just have Chelsea left. She is actually at home, logged in, doing some of her schoolwork, which is a and very she, big plus. She of, feels totally fine at this Yeah, point, she's so. like zero symptoms, still kind of tired. She had like a two and a half day run of it. Not even that. Like the second day was really more just being tired with very mild cold symptoms. So I'm very hopeful that she will test negative, um, not tomorrow, well, I don't want to test her tomorrow. If I can get another by next test that's a fast test, like it is easy to use. Why don't we want to test her? No, I do want to test her, but if I need to get a hold of the right kind of test that's easy to use. At this point, we have zero tests left. I don't know how we're going to test her, which is one of our missions right now, is to go and try and find one. And I can test her, if I, it's an easy test to use, I can test her first thing Wednesday morning before she goes to school so that I guarantee that she has a negative test to be able to go to school. But yes, that's one of our missions right now is to go to Walgreens to try and get at least one more test to get her tested in a school. Oh, he's on a mission. Hang on oh, one second. Cold. I got to hold making on. Light. Making, making the light. light. Making the light. Oh, I'm turning sideways. Oh, please. Oh, look how I straightened out. I did not do anything. <laughs> I did not. Turned her to the whole hips. I, like... because the car was turned on its side when you went around that corner. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, you're hilarious, I uh, I did nothing. Like, I had to hold on to the car. I'm like driving Miss Daisy here. You, uh -uh. You're going to be one of these little old ladies. Like, ah, slow down. Slow down. The kids don't complain about my driving. Let's just say that. They don't complain about my driving. Yeah, they did. Eight teenagers in the back of this car complained oh, about your driving. they team. were complaining. They were just being like Uber, like, you don't have two hands at four and five or whatever the heck you have. I know, whatever. Three and five. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, we also have to go to the bank. I have a package here to open, but I don't remember what I ordered from Amazon. Oh, someone just willy-nilly ordering on the whim. Yeah, I'm ordering um, N95s. That actually might be what it is. I ordered N95s, and did we catch that yesterday on camera? I haven't edited that part of the video where Ashley was like, it's KN95. <laughs> she knows oh, that there's yeah, two different types of 95 masks. Anyway, um... So Chelsea is back at home, go back to that. She's at home doing her schoolwork on her computer. She can log in, check into every class. She's emailed her teachers, check to see what te like any assignments she has to work on and she'll, she'll continue to do that throughout the day. But I'm very proud of her. She's just being good and she's like, are you going out to get me nuggets? <laughs> I'm like, you can have nuggets, my friend. I got her ice cream sandwiches the other day too because she's just, she's dealing with it really well. When you feel better when you're in quarantine, as a kid, you can like, well, why can't I go? Why can't I go play? I feel fine. I can go outside and ride my bike. But she is like, she's doing all the things. Plus, she's such a social kid. She really digs. Yeah. Uh, but she knows this. She knows what the deal is. She knows how serious it is. She's just willing to do it. And I'm yeah, really proud of her. Good. So, running errands and uh, see how the kids do at school today. We always kind of ask them now, like, hey, what was the, uh, 
what was the uh, classroom count because <laughs> they're the numbers are going down and down and down yeah, as this is kind of like raging through our community you know, like third, it's third taking a little while to, it's taking a little while to get to us because I think because these kids are doing so good and because we still have masks in place but it sneaks through at that lunchtime. I think that's really what's getting it the most is it's sneaking through at lunchtime when they have their masks off for 10 minutes. So you do the best you can and then you gotta eat and they space them as much as they can and it's inevitable. This one is a very spreadable one. So I'm just opening up mail as we drive around here and I got this little mat to go in the car. I literally ordered this back in November. <laughs> I just totally forgot about it. I don't know if it was from Amazon or from, I don't even know what it was, but I need to attach this guy here. It has like the little sticky on there. And then you attach that here, and then I believe it'll swivel, I'm not positive, but I gotta figure that out. But it, this doesn't have to stick to your car, but it's like rubbery, so it's like not moving at all. And then I can actually set my camera here as well, and it won't move. So I gotta figure out to like, um, how to like set it here and then aim it at me when I'm driving and uh, but Then my phone can go right here and I have access to it But I think this is too far away over here, and then it's gonna cover my speaker up up there. Whoops Turned it on the radio anyway, I gotta figure it out um, but if it was over the top of this it wouldn't be as big a deal because I can still move it if I want to but it also might mean my turtle need, might need to move but I Marco Polo my sisters in the car quite often and uh, I don't like to have to hold my phone because I need to like pay attention to driving, correct? Should be. <laughs> Mr. Negative. <laughs> and so this is easier. I can just turn it on and Marco Polo and anyway, it'll be good. I like it. Um, kind of fiddle with it and see if it will work for me. Okay. Take as many as they'll get you. Yep, yep. Okay gonna go into Walgreens. Where did he go? Where did he go? Right there. To get COVID tests. Lula said you just walk up to the counter at the pharmacy and you're like, I'd like a test. <laughs> Hopefully we're gonna get at least one more two pack. I need to get Chelsea tested and then I wouldn't, if she's positive, if she's negative and she's cleared for school, I wouldn't mind testing myself and double make and just make sure that we've cleared the whole family and that we're at a clean slate. Jason said everyone at the bus stop was like, oh yeah, we had it last week or I don't know. I knew that there was a lot of people missing from the bus stop, but I didn't know for sure like why. So <laughs> it's starting to become more and more clear. Anyway, we'll see if he has any luck coming out with the test. That is not a good sign. They don't have any, they don't know when they're gonna get more. Uh, hey, Chels. What? Look what I got for you. Nuggets and smoothie. I got a straw. All right, I'm gonna set it down, okay? <laughs> Step All right. down and walk away slowly. Shut your door. Dangerous room. Oh, no! <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> hey, boo. Bye. How was school? <laughs> yeah? You can take your mask off, but go put it right into the washer. You have a good time at school? Yeah, but yeah, like, one day I can play, Kala can't play. Yeah, we need to maybe do one more day. I was just texting her mom. I know, we just need to get Chelsea's negative test tomorrow, okay? How, but how was school? Why, Why is your bummy so cute? <laughs> huh? I don't have very many years left of you um, letting me touch your bum, so. What? I just found all of our Christmas cards as I was cleaning my office yesterday. Maybe we should show everyone. Turn the light on real quick. Okay. So here is our card from this year. I actually still have some if you guys are new or didn't get one of these cards. You can go send me your address over on Instagram because um, I still have a ton of these. <laughs> And I actually have more of these ones from last year, too, if you want one of these ones. And mm -hmm. I might have one extra of the year before. Let's go back. This is from 2021. This is our Christmas card. And then that was 2020, longest year ever. This is my favorite, but I wish we had had better light to get more of a close-up shot. Yeah, but I love this tree. Bright pink. We should do this, oh, do this one again. And then that one is the year before. This was literally like, what, two months before the pandemic hit? Yep. We had no idea what we were in for, did we? None. No idea. And then, I don't know what year this is. You well, had to have been like four. 
In that picture, I can't tell. This is on Well, when, what Oahu. year did we go? Yeah, I could figure out what year we went to Oahu. This is the um, Ko'olina Beach Resort. That's where we stayed. And then the Disney Resort is like the, right over here. Yeah. This is the lagoon for the Ko'olina. This is, I Wait. think, Lagoon 3 or 2. Anyway, my cousin actually took these photos. And I would love to go back to Oahu and have her take her photos again. I've just been working on the computer. Seems like Jason took a nap. He actually like went upstairs and did a hardcore nap, got into bed. <laughs> so he just woke up and got her from the bus stop. Kaylee and Abby are home and they said school went well. So we are three kids down, back to normal life and one kid to go. I think she would have stayed home in quarantine for a long time if she had had a friend to play with, right? Oh my goodness. Okay. She's trying to figure out on my phone what year that was from. All right, so leave it to Ashley. She started looking through these photos to try and figure out what year we went to Oahu. I'm trying to find the best way to like have you guys look at these photos because I don't want to like, I have to download them to even look at them on my phone. Like, let's see, it's trying to download them. They're all in the cloud. So I can't listen to the videos at all, but oh, it makes me miss it so much. Look at Jason and his little girls. So we did decide that these were um, from 2018. So Ashley was barely five. And, oh, she's coming back in. This is at the Ko'olina um, Lagoon and the um, Ko'olina Beach Resort. It's right next to the Disney Resort. I mean, like, seriously, people. Like, how is that not heaven right there? Oh, I can play it. Can I play it? It's is it thinking? No oh, yeah. See, it won't, like, oh, here, hit play. No, but there's no sound. I know. See, I think it's just, I don't want to have to download it from the cloud. We'll just look at pictures. Feet, you can't look at. <laughs> uh, there's Kaylee. Look at that. Oh, that was preteen life. All of the girls right there. This is the resort right there. And then Aulani Disney is right over here. Oh, this is why we go, you guys. This is why we work hard all year long. <laughs> Selfies <laughs> in front of the lagoon. Oh dear, I wish I had a smaller body like that. We're working on that. Oh, look at us. Look at us youngins. Look at us parents just hanging out under the little hut. Hawaii life. I miss it you so much. Look at this. And they have these huts that are like built into the sand Jeez. and you just have to, you know, go and reserve them early in the day. We didn't do this on the last trip, type, you know, riding in the sand. So this is how we found out what year it was. <laughs> I need to remember to do that each year so we can remember it. Oh, look at that little boo. That's when I had that. Oh, I cannot wait to go again. This is my happy place, people. Let's see if I can find some cool photos. I just, the bad thing Look about that. Going, so you can see that's Aulani right there. The bad thing about going is I have to share a bed with Chelsea. It's not that bad. I mean, if that's your only bad part about going to Hawaii, you shouldn't complain about it. Right? Cheese. Cheese? Yeah. You need cheese? I thought we just got a big chunk of it. Or is it already gone? Gone. So I haven't really talked, well I talk about Hawaii all the time, that's a lie. C-H-E-E-S-E. -E -E. So I, oh I'm so excited. Jason and I have worked, uh, we haven't really talked about this little plan of ours. I did at one point and then I cut it all out of a video. <laughs> but I have been working on a plan and it is almost done for our trip to Hawaii. Just to give a little sneak peek into how we're making it possible to go again this year. And we went twice last year. We did pay full cost for the trip that Jason and I did for our anniversary. That was a gift that we gave to ourselves for our 20th, 20th anniversary. Um, and the trip before was paid for in 2019, pre-COVID. So um, how can we go again on a very limited budget? So our resort, we'll do another video as we get closer to this trip, but I'm just remembering about it, getting excited about it. Um, our resort is free yeah. points and Jason and I are working on a deal to get I would say 90% of our airfare for free cool right yeah no it'd be super awesome Dana's working it I... all we gotta figure out is how I can get 100% of my time off <laughs> no. otherwise it's gonna be five people going to Hawaii I know that's our only worry right now as of yesterday we we found out that like half of our flight are covered 
with points and miles. And now I've got to work on the other half, and that's just time. But we need another employee. <laughs> well, the one we we're going to have start working Thursday just, says she's going to become a life coach, so she's not going to start working. I know. That literally just happened today. No, I know. We'll, no. Negative Nellie's going to go and work out and get all the angst. <laughs> this is go realistic. This realistic is real. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> so but, uh, we have to add cheese to the list. She Thank just you. did. We're good. Good job. Good job. High five. Anyway, that's how we're making it possible. We finally kind of have a plan set forward, even for the future. Like I think we could actually get all our airfare paid for all the time. All the time, and our and then work towards getting like the resort and points and yeah, stuff. The resort would be just like a little bit, so we could be going to Hawaii for free eventually. Uh, I don't know about doing it every six months like we've been doing, but no, uh, that that was an, last year was an odd year. You have to admit that. Again. You're talking about wanting to do it again. I know, but it was an odd year. This is technically. I just <laughs> so the last 18 months have been an odd 18 months is what you're saying. Yes, it was a pandemic. We pay. I have to keep explaining this over and over no. again. We paid for our trip. I'm just waiting for the day when you start turning it into every two months. Well, we'll have to figure out how to make points work. I'm just, just because the points work doesn't mean we have to go. Go work out. We're going to end this video. But I... Again, disclaimer, we paid for last year's trip. We went a, a, almost exactly a year ago. We paid for that trip in 2019. We paid for that a long time ago. That was the first trip. And then you and I've already six. said, we, we splurged and we went on an anniversary trip. It was Which a gift. Which was great. Great. This is just a year after our norm, like <laughs> yearly trip. So if you classify the Hawaiian trip <laughs> as an anniversary, yes, it doesn't, doesn't count. count. <laughs> Man, how do I get away with this logic? <laughs> well, honestly, so the stuff I have in the living room really isn't my stuff in the way because it's technically, I gotta figure out what it's classified as. It's, so therefore it's not in the it's, way. It's, yes, it is still a mess. He's talking about his... Yeah, it's not a mess. <laughs> it is a clutter. Therefore a clutter doesn't count against my previous... Go message. work out. Go work out. <sighs> you guys. Anyway. <laughs> I make things happen. He makes fun of me, but he is actually internally very excited that we are making this trip next to free. We're not we're not going to talk about the spending money I have saved. We have money that we have to you know, use to go and spend and buy food and souvenirs and excursions and things like that. That will be money spent. But to have your resort free and your airfare 90 to 95% free, I'm sorry. But that, I need some credit for making that happen. And he helps to make it happen too, but I come up with the plan and I instigate the plan and I execute the plan and I make it happen. And he's, he'll have to like put a comment below to himself because he's got to give me the credit where credit is due. I help make it happen because I have the passion to make it happen. And we have one more school year before our goddaughter, our oldest, is done with school. And she's off doing her own thing. This is why I have a passion for it. Because I only have my kids at home with us for a very short time. I don't want to get emotional. But I will continue to do so in whatever way to create these memories. And for our family to truly relax and escape life, it's Hawaii. And, and it is right now, maybe it'll change. But I love my family and I will do everything I can for them. And I know he will too. And you know, anyway. <laughs> He can leave a comment below in three or so months when we've gone to Hawaii and say, all right, she was right, because he knows I'm right. He just doesn't like to admit it very often. We're gonna say goodnight to you guys. That's kind of, I wanted to like extend this video into tomorrow um, and see if we do test results for Chelsea, but I don't think we will because I need to wait until actual day five. I think her school will be kind of upset if I actually don't test on day five. So I will not test Chelsea tomorrow. I will be home alone with her tomorrow, and so I don't know that we're gonna be filming because I still can't be around her. So take care and maybe we'll be back with test results for Chelsea to see if she is in the clear and can be around the family again. I am actually secretly glad that we don't have a trip planned for February because this would stress me out to worry that we were gonna spread through our family and have to deal with this going into February and worried about our trip. So I'm secretly glad that's not when we're going. Take care and stay tuned because we still have one more COVID test to take care of. Okay, take care guys. Good night.